All right, it's a 2021 Toyota Corolla hatchback. Comes with the two liter four cylinder engine, it's a front wheel drive vehicle. You get your choice on a Corolla. You could get the two liter or the 1.8 liter. Get the two liter, it's definitely quicker. And let's see if we can. No, today we're not getting in, we're locked out. All right, so here we go. Here's the key. Uh, eliminate. That's another channel we watch on YouTube. This is what the remote looks like. Front side, back side. Now this one is equipped with, that's right, the one touch. So you open up the door and it unlocks just by touching it. It also has the, I'll just go ahead and get in here and show it to you. Here we go. Uh, one touch what do you call it push to start is that what they call it and uh, this has also got the larger display another option and pretty nice instrument cluster steering wheel controls for the radio it's got a lot of safety uh, additions like the uh, radar cruise control and the uh, I think it's called lane keep assist and lane tracking. You can see it even has the speed limit up there. So it finds speed limit signs and other signs and lets you know what's going on. About 147 miles on this. And here's your glove box with the manual. Nice soft surfaces everywhere. Toyota's kind of upping their game when it comes to interior design and materials. Here's your shifter. You got your sport, traction control. And in case you didn't know, that right there is a little cap. You take it off with a screwdriver or a key or something and then you can um, push down on that and change the gears. Let's say if your battery died or something like that, it gets you out of that lockout. You have electronic parking brake and also hold, um, which is like a hill thing. So if you're on a hill, it will hold you in one place. Then what we have is our uh, controls for the windows and the mirrors. Beautiful two-tone interior cloth. You know, I have no idea what this is. But they put them on both sides, both doors. It's a Toyota thing. Don't quite understand it. And there's your seats in the back. It gives you enough room. It's not, you got your backup camera right here. And underneath here is a button. This is the SE version. Got your stuff there. Optional rubber cargo mat. But that's the mat that comes with the Corolla and below here is where you have your spare tire and your jacking equipment so lots of room in here nice little hatchback does not come with the power shock absorbers back here only the manual ones and nice tail lights LED along with LED headlights aluminum wheels this is the pearl paint. That's not the name, but it's a white pearl. I'm not exactly sure what they call it. And there's this. You don't get hood shocks, but you get a hood rod. And here's your engine. Direct injection, air conditioning. 
And they just did a, a great job on the restyle. There you go. Beautiful little car. Handles real well. It's peppy. I'm not going to be driving it today. I just wanted to give you a walk around video. It's got disc brakes on the front and lo and behold, they're putting disc brakes on the rear. Now why won't they do that to the Tacoma buyer? Toyota drives me crazy with that one. They tried defending all the reasons why drum brakes are great, but everyone in the world switched to disc rear brakes. Oh well, they're pinching pennies and making money. And people pay for it because you get legendary Toyota reliability. All right, short video. Thanks for watching How to Heaven.